guys, welcome to another Heavy Metal Diecast video. Where's the box? <laughs> this is a good camouflage box, this one. Uh, here we have a MiG-29 AS Fulcrum from the uh, Slovakian Air Force. In 1993, the formal dissolution of Czechoslovakia happened, and the Slovakian Air Force was reformed once again. And this is what we have here. Um, the Czechoslovakian Air Force was divided between Slovakia and the new Czech Republic, and the new Slovakian Air Force found itself with a handful of MiG-29s. And this is one of those MiG-29s right here. This is by JC Wings. It is 172nd scale die cast. They are a limited run, and it's got the usual deal, a little packet with some ordnance in the flap, and some details of the aircraft there, um, some background details and everything like that. It is the typical JC sort of deal in the box, um, landing gear there and some gear doors there, the usual sort of collector card that does have its limited run number on there, but uh, with JC wings, remember they do not come with a stand, so if you do want to display these on the stand, you do have to buy those separately. So what we'll do, we will get this uh, Slovakian MiG-29 fulcrum out of the box. Here it is out of the box, and as usual with these JC wings, they do come with that uh, little base made of uh, that thick cardboard hardstock there, which you, if you want to you know, display your aircraft on there, it does come with that little base if you wish to use that. And we'll get that lid open and have a look at this, uh, this aircraft inside there. It is a very unique uh, paint scheme on this aircraft. It does look very tidy. So it does have that collector card. It is a limited run of 600. The same, same deal with that. We'll get the aircraft out of the packet and it does come out easy. I bought this brand new. As you can see, it does all have all the plastic on. I uh, paid $125 for this off a seller, and that was including the postage to me as well. And uh, it got to me all safely. And wow, this is <laughs> this is really nice. This comes up absolutely fantastic. I think this is mad. This um, color scheme is is great. Wow, this looks awesome. Hopefully, it comes up in the video. The detail of that paint scheme, it's like a, it's a sort of a digital um, paint scheme there of a, sort of the greys and whites and everything like that. It does look absolutely gorgeous. This looks really good. Um, but although the Slovakian Air Force do not use these any, any, any longer, as of uh, 2022, they retired their MiG-29s. And uh, they are going to be replaced by F-16s. So which is, uh, I suppose, a bit of a cheaper option. The F-16's a good aircraft and uh, easy to maintain and probably a bit cheaper to maintain as well. I th but I think this colour scheme is fantastic. We'll, uh, we'll flip it over on its back and have a look underneath. As you can see, it's got the uh, hard points there for the armament and uh, for all the, uh, if you want to put your landing gear in or if you want to have it uh, in flight mode, same deal there, the landing gear goes in there. We'll have a look at the details underneath there. As you can see, it's fantastic. It, it, this is a really nice uh, looking uh, aircraft. I've got to say, this is a pretty good one from JC Wings. I do, I do like it. And um, as of March of this year too, 2023, um, the Slovakian government... Uh, decided they will send their retired fleet of 13 MiG-29s to aid Ukrainians' war effort. So these are, the remaining aircraft of these are going to be sent over to, the, to Ukraine for them to, to use in their, uh, their ongoing war with Russia that's currently, unfortunately, happening. But um, I reckon we kit this out and have a look at it all complete with armament and gear. All right, so here we have it all kitted out. It does kit out nicely, and luckily it does come with some instructions, so uh, that is nice of them. Some um, companies do not provide you with instructions. And here is the little collector card that does have the uh, the specific number and a limited run of 600, and it also does have the usual sort of stuff on the back. But we'll check out this 
fulcrum all kitted out. It does uh, set up really nicely. It wasn't too hard to um, to put together. Either that or I'm starting to get the hang of this. <laughs> so, um, but I reckon it, it does come up reasonably nice. These wheels, uh, they do roll. Front ones, not so much, but the, the rear ones definitely do. And I reckon the details of the aircraft as a whole is pretty good. You just fit the pitter tube and the uh, all the ordnance under the wings and in the center pylon. And as I uh, earlier stated, these do not come with a stand, so you don't have to worry about that ordnance on the center pylon fouling with the stand, so, <laughs> because you do not have one. But I, I reckon, no, it comes up all right. I like it. So what we'll do is we'll uh, flip it over. And I think it looks pretty good. Hopefully you do as well. See if we can open up that cockpit a little bit. It doesn't open up a huge amount, but uh, I'll try and show you some of that detail in there. If it allows us. It's kind of kind of pretty hard, but um, it does have a little bit of uh, detail inside that cockpit. Which is reasonably nice. But I reckon uh, overall... This, this camo scheme, really nice. It, uh, I, I do like it. it. It does look very, very nice. And uh, you definitely will be pretty happy if you do get your hands on this particular version of a MiG-29 fulcrum. All right, well, I'll wind this video up. We'll just put it down on the deck. And it sits there nicely. We will zoom in a fraction for you. And so you can see the uh, beautiful paintwork on there. So once again, this is by JC Wings. It is 172nd scale. And it is a MiG-29 AS fulcrum from the first Letka of the Slovakian Air Force. I reckon it's a it's a fantastic looking beast, that's for sure. I reckon this comes up a treat. You'll be really happy if you do get your hands on one. And um, I think uh, I'll take some photos of this at the conclusion of this video, which is winding up right now. So you can check out this aircraft without the sausage fingers being in the way and have a look at it in all its digital camo glory. So, all right, guys, thank you so much. If you did like the video, throw us a like. That'd be fantastic. And as usual, if you have not subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. That would be really appreciated. All right, guys, thanks again for spending the time with me and watching another one of our videos. You have a fantastic rest of your day. Cheers, guys.